Hey guys, what's up? In this video, uh, I'm going to be showing you how to install plugins onto the Minecraft server we showed you how to make running bucket. So, a couple of people asked me how do I get set home and stuff. So, in this video, I'm going to be showing you where to get the set home plugins and how to install them. You also get why you warp, just set home, set spawns, and a bunch of other cool stuff, which is pretty awesome. So, first thing you need to do is you need to go ahead, go to the link in the description, and download this. So, it'll send you to this link here, and once it loads, pretty much what you've got to do is you've got to go to essentials.jar, and I'm pretty sure that's off, no, the essentials archive, archive, and just go ahead and click download. So then click save file. And just wait for it to download. So it shouldn't take too long to download depending on your internet connection. It's only 2.1 megabyte. But the servers aren't the best, so So yeah, pretty much once it's downloaded. Okay, so once it has downloaded, you can go ahead and close out your internet browser and all of the other stuff if you really want to. So, in the essentials.zip, there should be a few jar files inside this folder. So, as you can see, there's a few for your like, but your bands, your teleports, your protects, your god, your. I don't even know how to use most of these to be honest, but. Uh, there is all the basic commands in there, so I just went ahead and installed all those on my server. So pretty much, what you want to do is you want to copy all of these and just drag them into your plugins folder in your Minecraft server. And then when you open up terminal and enter cd, drag in the Minecraft folder. And then, you know, need to go get the code. From Minecraft.net, <laughs> then go ahead and click download, scroll down, and get that Java code which you went into terminal. Go ahead and hit enter, and as you can see, it's going to run the server with plugins. And as you can see, it's loaded essential warp, essential teller, stuff like that. And just to prove that this works, I'm just going to go ahead and open Minecraft. So, that's where. Open Minecraft. Right, so we're going to go ahead and click multiplayer. And we're going to go ahead and log into our local host, because that's what our server is running on. So if you're running the server on your own computer, you can just go ahead and type in localhost and click connect and it should connect. And as you can see, I'm in my server. Welcome Liam G. Simmons. And as you can see, it's just loading all the stuff. Still, so. And also, if you're an op, which I haven't made myself op for some reason yet, you can type forward slash god. See, I don't, I'm not an op yet for some reason, but just make myself up in terminal real quick by typing op liam g simmons and as you can see i'm now up right so for some reason it's taking a while to load these chunks it shouldn't take that long so i'm just going to disconnect and i'm going to reopen it For some reason it's taken a while. So yeah, this is either a glitch or yeah. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stop the server, delete my world folder, and then try again. So pretty much all you need to do to delete your world folder is delete world. Let's go ahead and drag that out, open back up terminal, and just go ahead and put in that code again. And it should load a world. So yeah, done. 
It's probably not going to work, I've got a feeling, but... Right, so this time it's worked, and as you can see, I'm in my Minecraft server. And if you're a knob like I am now, you can give yourself God mode by typing forward slash God. And then you can't die. And as you can see, God mode enabled. And you can also... Uh, you set your home home so you can also set your spawn point so just to show that this works I'm gonna do four slash set well I'm gonna go forward slash spawn and it's glitched again for some reason So I'm just going to type forward slash home real quick because it's glitched. Shouldn't it happen to you, but my server is actually really buggy at the moment. So, yeah, pretty much all the plugins do work. You can ban people type by typing forward slash ban. And I'm just going to ban myself just to show that it works. And as you can see, you have been banned. And then, if you do do something that done by accident, you can just go and into terminal type pardon Liam G Simmons or your username and it unbans the player so yeah I hope this video helped some of you guys out who wanted to install the plugins and if it did don't forget to give me a like it really helps me out and also don't forget to leave a comment telling us that it worked because it really shows the appreciation and it just shows other people that it does actually work so yeah thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one guys peace